Assalamu alaikum guys, this is your boy Fayazul Rahman aka the Saudi guy in Scotland No, the Scottish guy in Saudi Okay, today we are going to be talking about how to get your Saudi drivers or driving as we see in UK License in Saudi Arabia A couple of things before we begin Number one you need to have an Iqama, so you can't have a business visa, visit visa, etc, etc, etc. You need to have an Iqama. Number two, obviously you need to have a pre-existing um, British or American driving license. Uh, number three, you need to have two passport size photographs for the driving school. And the last thing that is make sure that you are not a woman. Because women cannot drive in this country, so yeah. If you meet all of these criteria, the last one being necessary, then here are the steps that you need to do. Number one, you need to pay for the driving license online or via an ATM. It's about 30 to 40 reals per year, so it's up to you how many years you want to buy the license for. When you pay for the license, make sure you keep the receipt either online or the physical receipt you get from the ATM as this is going to be your proof of payment. The next step is that you need to go and get the form from the actual driving school. So locate the nearest driving school, get the form from the driving school and the form is in two parts. The first part is your information. Um, but that needs to be filled in Arabic, so you can do two things. First of all, you can learn Arabic. Or secondly, you can go to one of the guys in the shacks in and around the driving school. They charge about 10 to 15 reals to fill it all in for you. The second part of the form is a medical. Um, they require an eye test and a blood test and a blood group as well so even if you have all of this information you still have to go and get it done it has to be signed and written on the actual piece of paper from a doctor usually in some cities or most cities the driving school they have clinics within the driving school so you don't need to go far however in some areas you have to locate the hospitals which could be a long and tedious task okay so make sure you know what's at the, the driving school and if not then you need to locate a hospital that does that for you the next step is a weird step and many of you who have done it or know somebody who has done it and um, they can tell you that experience but um, I've renewed my license twice now and each time they wanted me to give all of the forms um, in a green folder. So I don't know what, what that means but just make sure you have a green folder if you're worried about the size, dimensions, whatever. You can get a green folder from inside the driving school. There's some guys again in those shacks that are around there. Um, you can just pay them like 3 4 reals to give you the green folder. It's weird. But that's what it is. Once you have all of these things in order, everything is done, take the green folder inside to the driving school, hand it in to the guy. If he takes it, then you are done. It should take about a day or two. He'll tell you when to come back, what day and what time. Also, you'll get a text of MOI saying that your license has been printed. Congratulations. Drive carefully. I've been Fayaz. You've been my audience. It's been sick.